Hi, thanks for stopping by and checking out one of our videos. Real quick, you can find much more training for a low, low price at softwarevideo.com. We've been training people since 1994. We have online memberships for as low as a startup fee is 99 cents for seven days or just $14.95 per month for unlimited training and access 24-7. Or you can buy it on DVDs. You can see what our new releases are. You can find us by software title, by subject, by vendor, and up here at the top through our film strip you can go by our little characters here, graphic design illustrator and so forth. I want to scroll down here. Here's our memberships. Very affordable. They make great gifts. So check it out and enjoy this uh, free lesson on this uh, topic. We'll go back to our design tab and over here to backgrounds and we'll go down and we'll select this arrow. Let's do the format background. So what can we do here? Now we're on the fill tab so we can do a solid fill and now we see it's a solid fill and we can change the color and now I've changed the color there. I can make it a gradient fill and I can go ahead and change the color here as well and I could pick this color. Also in here while we're on the gradient fill we can pick the type we want and you can see it's changing over here on the left. You can see it change and pick whichever one you want. So you can play around with this until you find the one that you like for you. So right now we can have our gradient stop so we can change it where we want it to stop. And you can see that it's changing as I change that. And we could change the color like that and we can change the brightness. So just play with these little features here and I could apply it to all my slides. Okay, so we can do that. Also, we can go back up to picture or texture fill and I can hide background graphics but I want to change the texture and they give us all these different textures here. Well I like this one so I can select this texture and now I can apply it to all so we can change it. I can also insert from a file. Well, let's say I want to add my own picture well, I'm just going to grab a picture, any picture, and I'm going to select it, apply to all, and now you can see that I put a picture in the background of my slide. We can also add clip art. Just pick any clip art, apply, I can apply to all, and we change it that quick. So we can add our own pictures, we can tile, Look how it's all tiled, apply to all. So it's endless. And then we can even change the settings of the tile. And you can see as I move along here, it's changing in my document. So you can just play around with that. And we can do like a mirror, mirror type. Change the, change the transparency. Okay, and then we can do a pattern fill. And it gives us all these patterns and we can change the colors. And we can go to more colors. And I could change. If I wanted it to be blue, I could change my background color. Make it kind of Halloween. I can change the patterns, apply to all. So just go into here to your format background. It's right here down this list. Let's go ahead and reset our background. Close it. And again, I just went to format background to get to this window. 
We can also do picture corrections in here, picture color, artistic effects. So you just play with this and work on it yourself. And I'm going to close that. So that's how we go to and work with format background.